Hey everyone, how's it going? Big LT here. And this is kind of an update video for you guys because I'm sure you've been wondering why has the channel been so inactive? Why, where is the content? Where's this? Where's that? A few things about that. A, um, I got sick a while ago and I have been better for the last week, but I still have been coughing here and there. Um, I'm trying to figure a way to get rid of it as best as I can. Today it hasn't been as bad as the last few days, so I'm hoping it's kind of getting itself out of its out of my system, so to speak. Uh, second thing, also uh, this with the Spiral Two, the Spiral, well, yeah, Spiral Two, that's what it is. But no, the Spiral Reignite trilogy. Um, technically speaking, we weren't able to record that because um, something came up that hindered our recording's time for that. Hence, why it hasn't been continued yet. But we will be continuing it this Tuesday. Um, we were planning on Friday release, but technically speaking, something's making us come back there, back to Scotty's place early this for this week. Instead of having to go there on Friday, we're doing a Tuesday, and then the next week after that will be a Tuesday again, and then after that will be a Friday, and hopefully it'll flip flop back that way. Um, so yeah, and of course we'll that series I'll be joined by Scotty Boy Rules, obviously because it's gonna be at his place, and the Groby because he's there to watch wrestling with me and Scotty, which he's not the biggest fan of the NXT stuff, but you'll give him a little chance to know some of the NXT superstars before they get called up to the main roster, hopefully. Different topic altogether, I get it. Um, also, another thing, a, a new series will be kicking up sometime in the next few days. That will be with my good friend Hunter, although on, uh, on PlayStation he's known as Sharkman01. Um, I prefer to call him Hunter. It's not his real name or anything. Um, but it used to be, it, he had a, when I first met him, he had a gamer tag on PlayStation. Um, it was originally Hunter34534, which he doesn't use anymore. Because of that, I use Hunter over Sharkman or whatever. I just call him Hunter. He knows it. Um, but yeah, that, the, the series him and I will be doing, I don't know if I said it a bit, but it will be Payday 3. And... It will take us a few days to learn the ropes of the game first. We want to learn the ropes a little bit, get to know the game a little bit and everything. And it is a new payday game, and there's been some new tweaks from for this game that that weren't in the original, like the scaling of the difficulty as the heist continues. Uh, the longer you the longer you go into the heist, the higher the difficulty. I've been training myself as best I can to get ready for any chance of those higher difficulties, but no promises. <laughs> um, <coughs> excuse me. Um, food reviews. Uh, we'll be getting. We'll be uh, doing a few food reviews here pretty soon. Uh, those will also be recorded on a Tuesday when I'm at Scotty Boy Rules' place. Uh, that's also one of the other reasons why we're going to be at Scotty's place on Tuesday. It is our. It will be on. Um, our friend um, Schizo, which I was hoping he was going to be a part of this channel because he said he was going to come down and he was going to do something for us, but now he wasn't able to make it, but he had the stuff sent over to my place, of all things, and <coughs> excuse me, um, I'm going to be doing this at Scotty's place, apparently. I'm going to need the uh, cooking instructions again when it gets to that point. Hopefully, I can figure it all out. Um, so this food review isn't technically something you can get at a store. It is something that Schizo wanted us to do. I don't know if it'll be like an actual food review, so to speak. I think it'd be just kind of like a side one. It's like, well, this is something he makes and he wants our opinion on it. The only problem is he's not making it. I am. And I don't know jack squat about making this. So there is that. Um, also... Um, the Genshin series, it's not on hold, um, truth be told, but here's the thing about Genshin. Next month, I am going to be juggling between Genshin and the soon-released Honkai Star Rail, because that game finally, finally was able to be pre-ordered, and... It's weird because Genshin was free. I don't know why this one's paid, but I guess it's a big bundle thing because of the new stuff. But, um, technically speaking, I did get it pre ordered um, a couple of days ago, I think it was. Honkai Star Rail will be with S. Ed Parker as well. She has been playing it herself as well. I was surprised she actually wound up doing it herself. Um, 
But, I mean, Honkai will sound, sounds like it's a lot easier because of some of the stuff that goes on in the game. Um, the game comes out October 11th, if you guys are wondering, for PlayStation 5. And I am was looking so forward to doing Honkai Story Rail as soon as it came out. They announced that fall... Um, I don't know, it wasn't fall. I think it was like a Q4 2023 release. And I was like, uh, please don't be all the way to like November or December. Thankfully, no, it's in October. I was like, oh, thank God. I don't have to wait that long until a Q, a Q4 release. So, I'm happy. I'm happy. I get to, I get to play Honkai Star Real on PlayStation. Not anything wrong against my phone or anything. I just, I prefer consoles over mobile with the exception of Pokemon Go. Just throw it out there. Um, another series that's going to be kicking off in October, I think it's later in October, so it'll probably be a week or two by the time Honkai Star Rail releases. I think it's actually a week. Um, or a little over a week. It might be around the early 20 part of the, uh, of the month, but Hot Wheels Unleashed 2 Turbo Charge. That will be released onto, this, onto the channel. The good news is it won't be recorded off of my phone. It will be recorded off the system itself. And then I will upload it to my channel that way with basically the same kind of look how the original Hot Wheels Unleashed uh, series did. Where you see the uh, thumbnail of the car, the logo, and then you watch the video and it's just basically me in that track with the, using that car. So that's... That's gonna be fun because I have two channels I manage, and both of them and both of them are connected to the PlayStation. So I have to disconnect one of them and hop over to the other if I'm doing Hot Wheels, and then if I'm doing the other thing, I have to disconnect my main channel for the other channel. If you're curious about what the other channel is, I brought it up before. It's called the World Wide Food Division. If you like anime, if you like wrestling, go check it out. Um, there was something else I was gonna bring up when I thought of Hot Wheels. Oh, right, because I mentioned Waifu. Um, waifu Racing. There's more coming. The only problem is I have one idea that I want to do next. I haven't gotten around to doing it. Well, I mean, technically speaking, I have gotten around to doing what I wanted to do with it. But for some reason, it, it feels different than when I originally did this one race. So I'm going to be start using more custom races, um, at least for this game, over the actual race event that it, that it would use for some of these things, especially this one car. Um, I won't be doing it today as a time recording, but I will do it tomorrow. And then hopefully when it gets uploaded, you'll have that one video. And if I get any more, most, here's the thing about the wife racing. Most of it's gonna come from Forza, but I'm gonna try to do some, do my best to do some of the other racing games I have, like uh, Gran Turismo, um, I have the one Hot Wheels one, but that's the only one I've seen that had anything in uh, that has the, the one car that I only has anything anime related. I can double check a lot of them, but I I swear I've gone through those libraries so many times. There is another livery that's anime related for the same car, but if I'm going to do that, I'm going to have to buy the same exact car in the store, which it cycles every hour and a half. So it's like play the game an hour and a half, hopefully get the car. Or I guess well, I guess there's another way I can do it. I basically, I basically got the game from two systems, so I can just keep the one car on the one system and then do the other car on the other system and see if I can do it if it has the whole um, cross play uh, thing to it. Because I'm using the because the thing is the Miku one was on the uh, PS5 version of the game, which actually that livery is across all platforms because I have it on my Xbox Series S as well. Uh, for that version of the game, so I guess technically speaking, I can do I can do both. Um, I just got to see if this one livery is going to be both, or if it's just the one because they didn't get the cross bundle, or I don't know if there was a cross bundle or a cross play or whatever. I don't know, but anyway, uh, I'll look into maybe doing that too if if I need another one from Hot Wheels Unleashed. Uh, maybe you'd be maybe it'll be another one to look forward to before um, Hot Wheels Unleashed Two uh, Turbo Charge releases. So there's that. And then there's another game that I have too that has a anime livery. It's another Mika one. It's on the crew too. Um, I have the perfect race in mind for that one. It's going to be a long one. But odds, I mean, first off, I'm going to have to take a little practice to get, to get good at the track again. I'm a little rusty. Especially when I took a break for a few months. Or was it a few months? 
Maybe there's more than that. I don't know. But anyway, um, I'm gonna need to take a little bit of. I'm gonna need to take some time to get good at the track again when I first did it. So there's that. Um, but like I said, a lot of them is gonna come from Forza and Gran Turismo. Most of it's Forza because the Forza community is just amazing with those deliveries. Same with Gran Turismo, but the, they don't got as many anime stuff. I mean, they got a lot of it, but a lot of it's just duplicates of the same anime character. Like you look up, you look at one car, you look at the anime stuff, you'll see like a bunch of Kurumi Tokasakis or Mikus, and usually I'm talking about Hatsune Miku here. Well, who else? Um, but you but you get like an occasional one here and there, like IA or um, oh, what's a good one? I, I guess Golden Darkness maybe is a good example. Um, I think I haven't really checked Golden Darkness's uh, deliveries. Then again, you have to search Yami for that, but whatever. But you get the point. So there's there's a whole thing with the waifu racing thing. Um, other than that, I think that's pretty much it about everything that's coming up here and there. Um, I do know that all the DLC for 2K23 have been released. Are we going to go back to doing my GM? With Scotty Boy rules, and my answer is no. I think once we do a series to the end, we think that's the only one. With the exception of some of my older ones I've, that I have up on my channel right now, like um, Shantae, um, Half Genie Hero might be an example. Even like even with um, I could even like remaster the uh, Shantae and the Seven Sirens one. I say remaster, even though the thumbnails are perfect, and all the th and the whole thing. But I say remaster because it needs commentary and i think i'll do that with parker over scotty and the groby unless the groby is with me and we just so happen to be doing the shante stuff he might he might enjoy it for like maybe one or two of them or something um i also brought this up in my community tab the assassin's creed 3 uh series is going to be on a long cancellation right now i say long because groby and i have been at assassin's creed for a whole year, um, I have roughly a whole year, because there was a point where around this time we did the original Assassin's Creed and then we did Assassin's Creed 2. And then around November, maybe December, I have to double check that, just it'll be up by then, so whatever. But it was around the winter time, me and him were doing the God of War Ragnarok series. That was our way of saying take a break from Assassin's Creed to do something else and got a war Ragnarok just so I happened to be the candidate. And then when we got done with that, then we hopped back on to Assassin's Creed with Brotherhood and the Revelations. We started doing three right away and we weren't getting the views. Like we used to we like we were getting originally. So I was thinking, okay, maybe the community maybe the viewers are a little bit burnt out on the Assassin's Creed stuff. So we need to find something different for a while. So that's kind of where these other let's plays are gonna come from. The spiral ones is one of them. Uh, the Honkai Star Rail, Payday 3, Hot Wheels on these two. Um, and I, here's the thing. I'll do something with Sky Boy Rules, but there's nothing really coming up for that. Oh, here's another one. Uh, Pokemon Violet. We will be doing that hopefully relatively soon. I don't know I don't know who I'm going to start that with. Either Parker or Sky and DeGroby or just DeGroby or whatever. Um, part of me wants to do part of me wants to do the first episode back to Pokemon Violet with Parker, and I know I'm gonna have. I know I'm gonna be at Skyboy Rose's place um, once uh, Tuesday rolls around. But a, he has to work, and we wouldn't be there until about roughly noon. And b, we're recording some Spyro, and I don't know how many levels I'm gonna be tackling in Spyro Two because there's gonna be some backtracking involved. Some levels are gonna be a little shorter than others. Um, kind of going that other, but. Basically, I think the first po the first episode back with the DLC, the newly released DLC, with Miku, will be with Parker um, instead of Sky Boy Rules and the Groby. I'll see if I can do that this week. So I got a little bit of a busy schedule to keep up this week with the uh, with the uh, Payday Three, the Spyro, and maybe even Pokemon for the time being, and the food reviews. So let's not forget that the food reviews too. And, I, and here's the thing. There are games that have already been released that I want to do for this channel as soon as I can. If I, if, if I can find some time 
to say, okay, there's not many games right now I can think of what's an idea. I'll do this one. For example, Nexomon was an idea and Nexomon Extinction. I want to do those with um, Parker, Scottie Boy Rose, and the Groby. All, all three of them with me for that series. Even if it's just like a do do a certain part of it with uh, Parker and do the other part with um, the Groby and Scottie Boy Rose. Or it could be just Parker in general. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, and there's one more thing. Um, Slime Rancher 2 is going to be getting an update soon. And Parker's excited. I'm excited. We're going to be jumping back into Slime Rancher 2 again, hopefully soon. I, I've been wanting to do something with... I've been wanting to do this one, one episode with her. For, for Slime Rancher 2 before the, even the update drops, if I can. I'm trying to test her about it. But um, there was a treasure pod that was added a long time ago, back in the spring. And I've had a hard time trying to find it up until summer, or at least I think it was like late May, kind of early summer, um, when basically I found this treasure pod. <coughs> Excuse me. And by the time I found it, Parker was busy fall summer. And then she got done in August, but then we basically had other stuff we were throwing in there. She didn't have time to do Slime Rancher 2. And I told her what was in the treasure pod. She already knows what's in it. And she's like, oh, is, this, is it important to do this like one video for the for this just one treasure pod? And it's like, well, I mean, I don't know. We can find something to do while we take care of this video, you know? We kind of bring up some of the stuff that's going to be happening in this update now is apparently a big talk, you know, would be a good discussion while you guys get a little bit of gameplay. Um, and then I think somewhere in the winter, there's going to be another update that's dropping. And we're equally excited about that too, so... Looking forward to it. Hopefully we get that started up again. So yeah, Slime Ranch 2 coming back. Um, a, a whole bunch of stuff. A whole bunch of stuff. Just mind-blowing a bunch of stuff. I guess there's one more thing I could say about Genshin. I should be done. But I did get a new character. At least I think I did. Um, yeah, I got a new character. New character. Um, part of the new updates. The uh, 4.0 that released... Um, I don't want, I shouldn't, I shouldn't spoil it, but, no, no, you want, I'm not going to spoil it, I'm not going to spoil it, you guys will have to tune into the next episode of Genshin to find out, to, uh, who I got, whenever I do it with Parker, so, I think that's it, uh, sorry for the long update video, but that's just what's going on right now, um, there's still other games, I think, that are still going to be releasing soon that I want to do a Let's Play on. Um, I'm going to double check the uh, PlayStation stuff here for a second. I'll just I'll just tell you guys what it is without going into too much detail if I can find anything here. Um, okay, I did bring this up to Skyboy Rules and the Groby. I'm not the biggest fan of horror games or horror or the horror genre genre in in general. Hard to say. Um, but I've seen gameplay of this, and I wouldn't mind doing a Let's Play on this, but Bendy and the Ink Machine and its sequel, Bendy and the Dark Revival. I will be the one playing it, as much as I hate the horror genre. But looking at the game, I think it's just fine. I think, I think it's just, I think it's fine enough to, for me to play. I wouldn't mind it in the slightest. And I'll be checking anything else. I don't see anything. The only other option I can think of is Minecraft Legends, but A, I've not bought it yet, and B, if I do do a Let's Play of that somehow, I would rather do it with my friend who's never been on this channel yet, and no, I'm not talking about Hunter. Hunter has been on the channel. We, we did Grand Theft Auto videos together, like the uh, Cop Rico heist with the uh, Panther statue, I believe, and the uh, Casino heist as well. The casino one, he's on. He's under 100, 3, 4, 5, 3, 0. And then the Carol Freak one, it was Sharkman's all one when he changed his gamer type. But um, no, this other one would be a friend of mine that I knew when I was a kid. Um, his brother was my classmate growing up in elementary school before I moved to another town just before my sixth grade year. But, you know, we, 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 we've done some stuff. He, to me, he is the minecraft expert he's probably played legends enough he's probably beaten it already i wouldn't mind if we did me and him did a 
let's play on it. I'll have to talk about it over the Maybe we'll even maybe even consider doing that Minecraft Dungeons one as a let's play, but I think we would have to do something where it was like completely wipe the state clean on our levels, or whatever. I don't know if he's up for that, but just not. And with that in mind, I will double check Xbox just to be just for ha ha. I I don't think there's many games on my wish list on Xbox anymore because. I don't hardly play Xbox as much as I play um, PlayStation these days, or even the, or even the Nintendo console. I'll double check. Um, I do know there's that new Forza Motorsport game, but that's also going to be listed under the waifu racing stuff, not so much of its own series or anything. And let's double check. No, that's the only game I have on my wish list. Well, I mean, I, I have Farming Simulator 15, 17, 19, but why would I ever do it? Consider doing a farming zone. I would love to, but I think that'll be more of a live stream than a let's play, and the live stream would take place on Twitch. So there's that. I I would not I would not do it. What, wait, what's the what? Hang on, hang on a second. I gotta look at this. What's that on sale? All oh, right, is that Sea of Thieves pirated for me? That's another thing I won't be doing to Sea of Thieves. I'm sorry. I was I was supposed to get back into it when Hunter got his Xbox. He did. We for a while we played it, and then we just presumed not to play it. And he went back to PlayStation. But anyway, now I think I'm good with my uh, my fun thing. I could look at my Switch or my wish list, but there, I'm I'm good. I'd have to walk over there and get it. But I'm I'm good. I'm good. But anyway, thanks for watching this update uh, video. Look forward to some of the stuff that's coming up. You guys have a good day. I'll see you guys next next time. Take care. Bye bye.